Hi right, guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. I've already done the tutorial, so we're gonna skip that. But basically, in this game, you can slow down time, and you're supposed to stop criminals from doing bad things by like throwing objects. It's pretty. It's a pretty game. Look at those bullets, bro. <laughs> They're going everywhere. And it's like flopping around. He's like, oh, I've been shot even though he missed me like 20 times. Watch this. Whoa, that trash bag just destroyed my whole body. My bones. <laughs> Full ragdoll. Complete. We did it. Huzzah. Oh, I'll probably just cut out all the load scenes because they just take forever. They're <laughs> so slow. I mean, besides that, it plays pretty smooth. The store! Uh-oh. Oh, no. He's hold it's the same guy! What? What are you doing here, dude? This dude's like, what a coke. Is this me? No, this isn't me. He doesn't have a watch on. Stop the robbery. Apprehend the money thief. Apprehend the snack thief. All right. What can I interact with? I think I could check before the, I actually start the level. I think that's what you're supposed to do. I don't see anything that's like golden though. This. Ah, you can get recordings. That's kind of cool. All right, all right. Let's well, we'll figure it out as we start. Can I knock? What the crap did that candy? Oh, oh goodness. <laughs> That was a vicious candy bar. Holy crap. <laughs> that just like full on ragdolled him. Is there only four levels? Music is lit though. Oh, we're on the roof. Oh, it's a vandalizer. Holy crap. Just push that dude off in a lot chair. I'm sure there's a collectible on like each stage probably. There it is. Oh, I got an idea. Watch this. It's gonna be awesome. Are y'all ready? If I wasn't trying to do this special, this wouldn't be too hard, but... Haha! <laughs> we did it. Okay. That dude's like... I don't know. He's like so calm in his little lawn chair. I wonder what's holding him there. Yeah, that dude's lawn chair was just like magically balancing. It's cool. Is this the last one? Dang. Dang, nabbit. What is that? Dynamite? Dynamite! <laughs> All right, interesting. Save all victims, defuse bomb, apprehend shooters. Oh, there's multiple shooters. Oh, where's the recording at though? It's a real question.
Oh man, there's a bunch of these dudes, for real. They're everywhere. I need to find the recording before I start this. What are these, like park bracelets? Hmm, I don't see it. I don't know if there is a recording on every stage or not. Maybe there is, maybe there isn't. I would assume so though, I don't know why they wouldn't. There it is. I gotta go back to the first stage and get the first recording. Alright, let's see all of this, see how it works out for us. Yeet! I win, right? God! Okay, thank you. I guess you just throw the bomb into space. I don't know why it didn't work the first time I tried it, but... It worked the second time! I think maybe I hit a civilian on accident, that's why it didn't work. Okay, we're missing the first one. God, is it on the... It has to be in there. Where would it have been at? I missed it somewhere. Oh, there it is. I see it now. It's underneath his feet. Lol. Boom. I really just need to go to the menu. Oh, his legs, you shot him. I wonder if I have to beat the level to get the recording. I don't think so. Collectibles. Let's listen to all the recordings. This is Chuck Knightley, recording oh, Chuck live from the steps of Tempest Corp Tower to cover an ongoing protest from the local oppositional group, Time Break. Huh. They believe that with the new LTM watches, Tempest Corp has gone too far. They state that with this power, corruption is inevitable. Time Break seems to have forgotten all the good Tempest Corp has done for the city. They brought us automated cars, free phones, and internet infrastructure. Oh, that's important. And now with the new localized time manipulators, they've given our noble police force a way to save lives before they are taken. Tempest Corp has once again proven that through technology, we can learn from the past to save the future. Hey. But we're still using recordings? Lol. <laughs> Interesting. A rash of crimes in this godforsaken city. A couple of days ago, a woman had her purse snatched while walking home from work. Excuse me. We found the purse abandoned in an alley with everything still in it except her phone. Not the phone. Today, a convenience store was robbed. One of the assailants was apprehended by a patrolling LTM cop, but a victim reported his wallet missing after the ordeal. Huh. Each crime happened within two blocks of the Tempest Corp Tower. And each victim was in some way related to Tempest Corp. The woman, a secretary for Tempest Corp CEO. And the store victim, a security guard whose building access card was in his now missing wallet. It's time break. Oh, God. Holding to something big. The time for peaceful protest has passed. They want to be remembered. Forever burned into everyone's mind. Isn't a puppet for Tempest Corp to manipulate. <sighs> Whatever their plans, this is only the beginning. Which makes me question what is their endgame? So blow up the park! Tempest Corp continues to ignore us. We tried being reasonable, we tried going through official government channels. Have you tried sucking their dick? Of time by a police <laughs> some Haven't tried everything, man. Society, but society has failed. 
They let Tempest Core control every aspect of their lives, from the phones they use to the cars they drive. They've become complacent, comfortable in the lie of an ignorant utopia. It's time to Papa. Stalker Sasquatch. We swiped his building access card and stashed it before the LTM With complete access to the tower and the CEO schedule, we're going to send a message that nobody will You mess with time, you do with the repercussions of breaking it. Oh, they messed up. It's supposed to be if you mess with time, you gotta pay for the crime. Dang. Come on now. Bunch of losers. We have left, and it is a mighty fine piece of work, if I do say so myself. I expect each of you to bring me one of those fine watches, as I think our little exhibit here is still a bit dry, don't you think? Mm. Go on, boys. Show them who we are. Alright, well, at least I added some story to the game, kind of. Alright guys, I'm gonna review this game, but thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, but the thing, the problems I have with this game is that there's not much to do with the slow time aspect besides throw things. And the levels are like super simple. Except for the last one. The last one's kind of hard because you can really mess it up by like hitting a bottle through like an enemy and a good guy. And then you have to launch a bomb into space. So that part was, it was challenging just because... Like, how is a bottle that I'm throwing, like, completely ragdolling someone anyways? It doesn't really make sense, but besides that, the game, it, it's a good start for a game, but there's a lot of things they need to add, like more mechanics, more challenge, maybe something that would give me, like, a sense of urgency on why to do things. But over, the graphics are really pretty, is a good thing. The music's good. I love the wah wah part, that's pretty lit. Um, but yeah, and they added these recordings, which are I, right, I guess. It was a, it was an eye game. It wasn't great, but it was I. Right. Thanks for watching, as always. Bye.